One of the reasons Super Mario 3D World is so beloved is its characters. Unlike some other Nintendo games out there, every character in the game has their own set of strengths and weaknesses that makes them stand out from the pack. Luigi's strength is his jump height, being able to reach places that no one else in the cast can. Toad's strength is his incredible speed, making everyone else seem like a snail in comparison. Peach's strength is her floatability, allowing her to cross gaps with ease that no one else can. And Mario, well, he's Mario. Don't worry about him. Do um, you want Mario? Race? No, no one wants Mario, let's be real. <laughs> what if a mod existed that took each character's strengths and amplified them to be even stronger? Well, look no further, because that's exactly what I've created. Luigi can now jump even higher, Toad can run even faster, Peach can float even longer, and Mario, uh, he's more mediocre? If we jump with Luigi, he's just gone. He just has his height on everything doubled. <laughs> so if he does a backflip, he's just out of there, dude. What we have decided to do here for Peach's thing is uh, since the float is a pretty strong thing on its own, we've left everything else the same. But once you decide to float, you can really float. You can just completely skip entire sections of the level because now you're floating for so long that it doesn't even matter. So what we have done is we've gone in and we've doubled Toad's speed. So even if we don't hold any other buttons other than the joystick, you can see that this man is on the move. But once we add in the run button, he is moving. He's actually tearing it up right now. So when we're playing as Mario, normally he's kind of an all-arounder. So let's see what happens when we try to run with him. As you can see, we are making big progress here. But just playing the game like this wouldn't be enough for me. So instead of simply playing through the game with each character like this, I'm instead going to speedrun it. A few months ago, I recently spent 24 hours in 3D World attempting to get as good of a time as possible. During that stream, I got a personal best time down to a mere 2 hours and 15 minutes, and have since lowered it even further, down to about 2 hours as of today, which is a perfect milestone to shoot for. I mean, with each character having insane stats like this, it should be easy enough to blaze past my personal best time, right? Wrong. You see, there's one more rule that I haven't mentioned yet. Instead of using the correct character on each level for the speedrun like I do normally, I'll instead be hitting the random button at the beginning of each stage. In a perfect world, the stars align and every level gives me the perfect character to fly right through it. But with a 25% chance to get this guy every level, I'm bound to be in for a wild ride. All right, here we go. The journey is happening. Reminder, guys, we are randoming it at every stage of the game. Okay, we got Luigi. We need to take advantage of his, his ability to jump very high. <laughs> Superhero Luigi. Look at this. Look at the movement. Look at the movement on this guy. Look at this. We can just jump over this. We don't even need to climb up that wall. Heck the wall. I'm out of here. I'm intentionally randomizing it. There's that element of RNG, so you never know. We did get Toad. Look at this man go. Look at this man. He's juicing. Toad is on something, man. Uh, I did not mod Captain Toad. Oh, crap. I need that star. Oh, crap. I need the star. I need the star. I need it. We have to get that. I gotta get the star, dude. Okay, got it. <laughs> He's too fast. Okay, uh... Yep, everything's going great so far. Oh no! Oh crap, Toad. Okay, just go in. Yep, no, what, whatever, this is fine. So Toad going fast is great, but it's also kind of hard to control him. You do even the slightest turn and he's just, he's out of there. Oh, we got Peach. This is actually a good level for Peach. Okay, so the reason why this is a good level for Peach is because we can just do this crap and just skip a large chunk of the level. Like, look at this, we just can literally glide all the way to the other part of the level. Hey, I'm not trying to throw, but these guys are... Well, it really comes down to the number of times that we get Mario, because Mario is gonna be a major time loss, but everyone else, in theory, should be a major time save. But, you know, we are randoming every character, so we never know when we're gonna get Mario or how many times we're gonna get him. Wait, <laughs> Can I just, like, jump over everything? I think I can do that. I feel like I can do that. Like, can I just make this jump? Oh, crap! No! <laughs> crap, 
My favorite thing is probably the crouch backflip. Look at this. <laughs> he's just gone, dude. Every time, every time you do that, he's just out of there. Okay, this is kind of a longer stage, so if we get Mario here, this would be really bad. This is a good toad level. Oh, God. All right, so the reason Mario's bad is because, as you can see here, the only way we can move with him is with momentum. Fortunately, we have the cat suit, so I kind of have to do cat dives the entire time. Otherwise, uh, we're never gonna make it through the level. Okay, I- I can't... Oh my god! Can you go this way, please, sir? No, dude, this is so- it's so hard to control my guy. Fortunately, we do have some speedrun tactics. This is when the speedrun strats are definitely gonna come into play. Because, uh, oh god, but getting in the pipe is gonna be so hard. How do we do that? Okay. That was a big time loss, dude. I don't know if we're beating this in under two hours. I'm gonna have to really get some major cheese with, like, a, a long peach float or something. Oh god, not Mario on Double Cherry Pass. We do have a cat suit, which is gonna make my life way easier, but I, I can only focus on one Mario. One of the Marios is gonna die. Dude, I'm getting Mario on the worst stages. I mean, look at this. Look at this absolute scoundrel. No! Dude, the Mario levels are disasters. Okay, we got Toad. Oh, but this is a bad level for Toad because we're on an auto-scroller. I mean, look at this guy. This man has speed, but what's he- it's getting wasted. Go, Toad, quick, get out of there, man. We've got a whole game to play. I need you to go. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Oh my god, he almost flew off the side. I mean, you could do this in multiplayer, but someone would be stuck playing Mario if you played with four people, and then that would kind of suck for that guy. Everyone would be having a great time, and then he would just be <laughs> in, in the corner running at one mile an hour. Wait, since we have Luigi, we can go for an insane skip. Watch this. <laughs> we're, we're so high in the air, dude. I didn't even get momentum. Normally, if you want to do a jump like that, you have to get momentum, but we could just do it normally. See, the thing about Luigi is that uh, he's kind of cracked. All right, give me, give me Toad for this. This is a good Toad level. Peach also would work here. Okay, okay, let's go Toad. Let's move it, man. We don't have all day. I need you to go fast. Okay, get in. Okay, get in the thing, though. Uh, can you get... Okay, get in. <clears throat> Let's go, Toad. Let's go, Toad. Peepas. We love the peepas. So I was trying to figure out how to make the Mario mod with the slow movement, and I, fi I, I figured out the speed variables, but if you set it to zero instead of just a very low number, like 0.1 or whatever, I think the math in the game gets thrown off because you start doing, like, division and, and multiplication by zero, and that screws up the values of everything. So what happened whenever I was doing the, uh, testing the mod as Mario with slow speed was, uh, when he would move, his model would disappear. You would only see the footsteps. And then at one point, he fell through the ground and the ceiling disappeared. And then he died and the game crashed. <laughs> so, I learned to not do that. So far, things were actually going well. Unfortunately, on 3-4, I got a rude awakening as to what the future of this run might hold for me. Oh my god. Wait, dude, how are we going to beat this one as Mario? I'm going to try my best to get the stars that you normally get here. But with, with 99 seconds, this is not gonna be pretty. I'll tell you right now. And I can't catch the rabbit! I can't! Oh, we got him. Huge. Okay. Okay. Okay, now I need to not die. No, the piranha plant killed my momentum! No! <laughs> Oh, this is a disaster. This would have been a great toad level. Actually, this would have been a great peach level. But instead, we got this... This guy. Wait, did I just unlock new tech? I can turn with momentum. That's big. New Mario tech just dropped. I have a little momentum. Wait, and then if I have momentum, I can do this. But I'm losing it. We're losing it, dude. We're running out of juice. We're running out of steam. Oh, oh. He's cooking. 
What is he cooking? No! <laughs> Give me the leaf, I don't care. Can I even do anything with this? It's not even good. It's not even good, dude. It's not- we're tied with the golden to- with the leaf, it doesn't even matter. Can't even do it with baby mode. <laughs> First try. Huge. Dude, we're wasting our toad levels. We keep getting toad on levels where he's not good. I mean, he's still good, but we need him on long stages. Okay, I think we're actually gonna go do this level. This is not on the speedrun route, but we need some green stars. We need some green stars, and there's a couple quick ones here, especially if we get Toad. Okay, Luigi's actually very good for this. Because we hit the boost panel, and then we can just do this. <laughs> like, I can jump down here and grab this, and then just jump right back up. It doesn't even matter. Well, if I remember correctly, one of the green stars here actually needs height at the end, and we can probably get to it with Luigi without a power-up, which is nice. See, we just do this. <laughs> it's just that easy. Just jump up there. Just hit the jump button, forehead. Plumbing is their game. They found a secret warp zone while working on the drain. Oh, wait, Peach Floater. Hold up. This is a great level for Peach, actually. This might be the best person we could have possibly gotten on this stage. Okay, so watch this. Watch this. We just do this, and then we come over here, and we do this, and then we do... I go a little bit like this, but then I can just do, we just do this, and we just float it over. Like, I think, can I do this? I think I can just float to where the green star is. <laughs> okay, look, we got it. For the record, if I didn't bonk, we save it. Look, I'll even go for the insane skip here, look at this. You just have to believe. With the floaters, boom, we're out of here. Honestly, better than my speed run. Normally, when I play that level, it goes way worse in the speed run. So we're gonna take, we're gonna call that a dub. Oh God, why do we have to get him on the boss fight, dude? Okay, but I think he can still do the tech. We can still do the tech with him. Fortunately, this boss is pretty uh, non-interactive. You just have to sand here. So we should be able to do the tech still. Mario, you gotta, you gotta be on the side. There we go. You know, honestly, it could have been worse. It definitely could have been worse. I thought I was fine on green stars, but we got the backups. So we are actually even with where you need to be by this point of the, uh, the speed run. 50 is good. Mario is exuding a kind of Waffle House energy. <laughs> I, <laughs> I know what you mean. I agree. Okay, I need to try to not die here. Toad, what did I just tell you, man? Go. Run free, my child, yes! Oh, look at that, though. Oh my god, we're kind of cooking. That was kind of nice. I'm not even gonna lie. That was clean. I normally don't do beat, bo beat block Skyway, but I think if we get a good character for this, this could be solid. Like I can just jump over everything. So this might actually be, this might actually work out. Uh, okay, we need to get... Well, in this game, they're not... Dude, we went too high. We died off the top in the ceiling. I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> okay, let's, let's not do that. You think I care about your blocks? Okay, I kind of care. I kind of care a little bit. I kind of care a little bit about the blocks. I needed the blocks, dude. Are right, we going to do the 4-2 warp? Who are we going to get for this? Oh, God, it's Mario. Here we go. Classic Mario move right there. He just dies instantly. Okay, this is very important what we're about to do here. Okay, we want to do this. Boom! That was so hard, you have no idea. Oh my god, we made it out though, it's fine. We just needed to hit the warp pipe. Going into World 5, things had actually continued to progress at a reasonable rate. I had gotten a few good rolls for characters on the past few levels, and had actually made decent-ish progress in mastering the scuffed Mario controls as well. At this point, I was about halfway through the main game and had about half of the green stars needed as well. 
This meant that if things continued at their current rate, it'd be close, but maybe I'd be able to pull off the two-hour goal after all with a bit of good luck. I, I swear, though, we're wasting Toad on all these boss fight levels. We need Toad on the levels where you actually need to go fast. Oh, this is a great one for the Peach floatiness on. See, this should be a safe level for Peach because there's like a 0% chance I die on this part. Which is generally when most people mess it up. And now we can just do this. And float all the way to the goal. It's great. It's incredible. We love that. We definitely save time on that for sure. If we can get Toad here, this would be great. We've got a 1 in 4 chance. Oh god. We got the goon squad member. Okay, but we've we we're trying to work on controlling Mario better. Okay, wait a minute. I'm kind of I'm kind of doing it. Oh god. Wait a minute. Can you grab it? Grab it please. Thank you. Uh uh Mario, get the star. My man. Okay, if we make it through this level, it's a miracle. I don't even know if I'd go for the green star here. The the third one. I think we just try to get out. Oh. Wait a minute. Are we out of here? We didn't die. It's a miracle. Somehow, not game over. That was really hard. The shadow timer is a result of the chat demanding a timer. They said they were going to riot if I didn't give them their own timer. So I did. Yep, you're doing it, Mario. Keep it up. Keep it up, bud. Okay, the best way to control Mario is to do one of these, and then you don't hit the sprint button. How do I do this? I think we have to sacrifice. We gotta sacrifice that one. There's no, there's no way we can get that green star with Mario. However, if I get... The feller, the feller will help us. Oh God, wait, no, I don't have any momentum. I, I need momentum with the feller box. I think it's, wait, wait, we can do this. We can do this. Okay. Yes, nice. That was close, we made it though. Oh, we're going fast. Time to go fast. Well, we can just do this. Dude, Toad is zooming. Toad is cracked. Oh, that was nice. Okay, you know what? This is not a terrible level to get Mario on. Everything is fine. Oh my god. No! <laughs> oh. This is probably one of the worst levels to get Mario on, if I'm being honest, though. <laughs> Everything is fine. Okay, nice. Let- wait, wait a minute. We're doing it. Oh my god, wait, I'm going backwards! What was that? <laughs> Did I have, like, negative momentum? I've never seen that. Okay, can- Okay, can we get to the- Thank you. Okay, we still have to not die on the Boom Boom fight, though. Which is gonna be easier said than done. I don't know how we're gonna survive this. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. This is not good. Or this is good, sorry. Ooh, we clutched up, that was big. That was a huge moment. You know how a few minutes ago I was talking about things working out okay if I got good luck? Yeah, so that didn't happen. As I worked through the remainder of World 5 and into World 6, I just couldn't get away from this red hat wearing mustached man. It was almost as if he heard me talking crap, because not only did he keep showing up, he kept showing up on some of the longest and worst levels possible, making my life a nightmare. Another Mario classic, okay. This is about to be an instant Mario classic right here. Just trust me, guys. No! Oh god. This is not- this is not ideal. Mario, please! Mario, I need to- I have to do damage at some point. We got Koombat. Oh, that was actually clutch. That was actually a clutch kill there. Oh my god. Dude, if we get... I didn't realize how rough it would be to do the world 7 and 8 stages as Mario, but it is so hard. It's actually so difficult. Okay, 
Give me Toad for this. Actually, you know what? Don't give me Toad. Wait. Random, random, random. What do we got? What do we got? Uh, Luigi would probably work. What can we do with Luigi here? Oh, we can do a lot, actually. Oh my god. He's so... Where is he? No, he's going to... Wait, no. <laughs> Have I thought about writing? I'm not much of a good writer. I do write some scripts, though. Writing D's nuts. <laughs> okay. Dude. Now we get Mario once again. Oh, God. This is a rough one for Mr. Mario. Guys, we can still... Guys, we can still do it. Okay, I'm not even trying to get the greens. I'm just trying to get across. How many... How many... Levels have... Been ruined by this man in the red hat. Okay, long jump tech. No! <laughs> we finally got the, the, the cheater leap. Just give me that. No! Oh my... Dude, I'm just trying to get the leap. <laughs> I'm just, I just want to get it. Oh my god, this is unbelievable. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> the leaf cannot save me, dude. The leaf is a downgrade. Dude, I'm just thinking about what this level would be like if we had gotten, like, Toad or Peach. With Peach, I could have just floated past everything. Okay, we're getting better, though. We are, we are getting here. We're getting it down. We're getting it down. It's coming together. Oh. Oh, what the heck was that? How did I do that? <laughs> I get the green. We, we sack for it. Sack for the green. Oh, wait a minute. We're, we're living it. We're living it. Oh, oh. No! <laughs> that was so good until it wasn't good, dude. What was that, dude? Okay, we use... I need to get in the hole. Nice. Nice holage. Okay, okay. First try! We did it! Uh, look at that. Now we just have to beat... Uh, let me check my watch here. A world and a half in... A minute and a half. I think we can do that. Maybe I still need... 45 green stars, okay? But really, who's who's counting? Dude, I'm wasting all of my toad ones on the bosses. I want to get more toad action. Look at this guy. <laughs> Dude, he's too fast. We did not finish in under two hours. You can blame it on Mario, though. This is why we don't trust this guy. I really hope I beat it in three hours. If I beat it in over three hours, something went terribly wrong. There's only one world left. If it takes me over an hour to beat one final world, then we've got problems. Okay, well, if it's all Mario, then maybe, yes, it'll take an hour. But I'm very much hoping that that does not happen. Uh, let me go nerd mode for a second here. Got to push up my glasses. That is, uh, theoretically possible, but statistically improbable. If you evaluate the number of remaining levels and multiply that by the chance of getting Mario per stage, to get the total- Okay, well, we got Mario again. This is a disaster. Let's- I might need to just get the game over here. So I can get- reset the live counter, because if I get the green star and then game over, it doesn't matter. Okay, well, we're dead. The checkpoint. We must get there. We can do it. Get to the checkpoint. Get to the checkpoint. Get to the checkpoint. Please. Thank you. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's go, Mario. I don't know how this is gonna work. Hopefully we can get a quick, uh, takedown, though. Okay, there we go. That's one hit. Oh god, not the spikes. Okay. Wait, this is actually going better than I thought. Okay, throw- throw the ball. Thank you. Mission accomplished! Mario, get out of here and please don't show up in World 8. <laughs> I'm begging you over here, man. Give me a break. Mario's out here ruining my life single-handedly. 
Okay, so maybe this whole two-hour goal thing might have been a bit overly optimistic. I mean, who would have thought that Mario, someone with only a 25% chance to appear on every level, could cause such chaos? Fortunately, at this point, with only one world and a handful of levels left, we'll surely get good enough rolls to clean up the remaining stages quickly, right? I'm not even gonna lie, I'm kind of gaming right now. <laughs> okay, man, well... Okay, maybe... Not anymore, but I was definitely gaming. Okay, now we're actually gaming. For real this time. Legit, real gaming happening. Live on your game screen. Oh! <laughs> Dude! Okay, wait, 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 wait. Now we're gaming. Now we're gaming. Watch this. Do this, and then we do that. Yep, gamed. Definitely no problems there whatsoever. Okay, please don't give me Mario on this one. I'm begging you. Oh my god. Okay, all right. It should be. Look, it's fine. We can. It'll be fine. We can do this. Don't worry. As long as we don't die on the boss, we're chilling. I'm sure nothing bad will happen from this fight. No! Oh, no. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. G guys, 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 focus. Focus, focus. Remember the plan. Remember the game plan here. Oh, no. Dude. It's okay. Wait, I got a life. So we didn't game over. Here's the tip of the pom-pom fight. Only shoot your enemies from underneath. That was what I was missing. I think we can do it now. Thank you, bot, for telling me what to do. Okay, I'm going for the underneath strat. There it is, there it is, there it is. Underneath. That's what we needed. The underneath strat. It's so obvious. Why didn't I think of that? Ooh, it's time for Toad. This might be a good one for Toad. Look at him. Toad, it's time, it's time to go crazy mode. Okay, not that, not that crazy. That's a little too much, man. We need, to, we need you to chill out. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at that. Do you see that? Okay, note to self. Don't do whatever. Whoa! I think we can make this. Toad, you know what to do. Where was your speed, Toad? Where did it go? Ooh, let's go. Ooh, this is the ultimate peach level. Normally on this one, we do cat strats. But I think we can get a little more creative with peach here than normal. Because we have the ability to do this. Which, as it turns out, is, uh, pretty strong. And then this one right here, we can just do this. Okay, well... <laughs> well, you can do that if you if you don't do what I did. Okay, I'm gonna go for a speedrun strat here, but I don't know if it's possible. Oh, wait. There we go. No! <laughs> we were candling, dude! We go for the power reset. The bonge reset. The power reset. Oh my god. New technology. Never before seen in this game. Okay, here we go. We've got two boss fights and then a final. Let's go, Peach. Peach and Peach. The peach change is very subtle. I feel like it's the least noticeable, but it's very impactful. I mean, look at this. Okay, well, you didn't get to look at it there. But look, look at this. Look at how long we're in the air for. <laughs> okay, maybe that was not the best place to show that off. Good work, peach and peach and peach. This one would be a great Mario level, actually. Wait, actually, no, this is even better for Luigi. This is pro Luigi's probably the best person to have this boss fight on. Like, look at this. Hello, nice, <laughs> nice boss fight you have here. Let me just do this. <laughs> this is the, the world record strat. If you want to beat this boss as fast as possible, use this method. <laughs> Guaranteed easy victory.
If it's Mario in the final level, though, we're, we're gonna be boned, man. Like, there's no chance. Oh, we got Toad! Let's go! The Toad finisher! McDonald's Toad on the scene. Look at him go, dude. <laughs> He's so fast. He's ready for action. Okay, maybe a little too fast, Toad. Okay, chill out a bit. Chill out a bit. Can I do this? Does this work? I just want to know. Oh my god. Toad's insane. Toad's the most insane gamer of all time. Woo! Oh my god, I almost ran into Bowser. We're like too fast. <laughs> if I try to skip this section, it's, it's a bit of a grief on my part. Oh yeah, it doesn't matter. Even if you get up here, you're just kind of stuck. Wait, where am I? Oh, more, I, what the? When did I get over here? <laughs> Dude, look at me go. Oh, God. Okay, okay, okay. Chill, chill, chill. Chill, bud, chill. This is the man of the hour. Keep your eye on this guy, because he's going to be going fast. All right, I actually need to kill this cat. Oh, you have it. I need to use this for the setup. You go here. Okay. Now we can maybe do the skip if I do it right. Okay, I didn't do it right. Oh god! We're taking hits! What is happening? Okay, I guess we're doing it legit. <laughs> Toad up blasted. I might be doing it. Nice. We did the skip! Toad, now you just need to not fly off the stairs. You're going a little too fast here. There's no guardrails, man. Chill out. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Okay, 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 okay. We should be able to get sub three on this. I think we did it. We've, we have completed the mission. Quick, edit the overlay. Good idea. We can do that. Guys, look away for a second. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Wait, I think we're going to accomplish the goal, guys. It says beat the game in under three hours. We can do it. Boom. There it is. We did it under three hours, just like we were trying to do from the very beginning. Incredible stuff. Ran round of applause. Really nailed it. <laughs> Definitely didn't move the goalposts at all. I don't know what you're talking about. This is legit. Trust me. So, in summary, what have we learned today? It's that we all hate Mario. And I feel like I already did, so my opinion did not change. But I feel like after today, we might have some new people joining the Mario hate bandwagon. Good thing we just barely managed to accomplish our goal of three hours that we definitely didn't change right at the end whatsoever, right? Thanks for watching.